Well, Rich, it's a two under feet today. Uh, just how, how tough was the game for the boys out there? Yeah, it was, it was difficult conditions whenever we've played up at Solihull. Was, you know what you're going to get, it's always a tough game. Um, but again, I, th I thought we we done well, I, th I thought we played well. Um, it's just a few small little minor things we need to work on just to put it right. We made a few sort of silly, silly decisions and things like that. And decisions went against us today, which I think ultimately cost us. Um, but as I said, loads of positives from the game. We, we keep building, we keep progressing and uh, we focus now on Tuesday to make sure we get three points home. And you've had three penalties to save so face, sorry, so yep. far this season. Uh, you've saved one of them. You've yep. gone the correct way for the other two. They've just been really good strikes. Yep. Uh, what did you make of the penalty decisions today? Um, what Viewing it from where I was, first of all, um, I personally think both of them were a little bit soft. I may change my mind, obviously, if I see it. Um, but I thought Con done very well to get back and make the tackle, um, like on a, a recovery run. And uh, I think on Rancy's one, I think like I said, I think he just sort of nudged him and he went, went down. So you either go smart play from a striker or soft pen. Um, but as I said, I, it's hard seeing it sort of uh, in first sight, but when I first saw it, I, I must admit, I both thought they were a little bit soft. But as I said, the ref probably had a better position than I did. And you've gone, like I say, these three penalties you face, you've gone the right way for all of them. So, so what goes through your mind? Do you do you research these? They took a two penalty takers here today, didn't they? Yeah. Um, no, I, I, I must admit, I don't really look into it at all um, because I think you can spend years um, sort of going and researching players and how they take penalties. But at the moment, sort of when they put the ball down, I don't think they have a rule unless someone's taken thirty penalties and took and put them to the right hand side of the goalkeeper 30 times then uh, I, I don't really pay attention to it too much to be perfectly honest with you um, so yeah I, I have my own sort of little routine with it and uh, yeah as I said it's I've, I've got quite a good record with penalty but as I said unfortunately I couldn't, couldn't keep the second one out um, I think if that one stays out maybe we sort of uh, get something out of the game so yeah d disappointing but as I said we've, we've got to brush ourselves down really quick and uh, look forward to Tuesday. Is it a sort of mind games with penalties with keepers and strikers? Do you try and psych them out? Is it anything like that? Yeah, there, there is a little bit that goes on. Um, yeah, there, there is something that goes on. As I said, uh, I've, I've got a few little tricks up, up my sleeve which I like to try. And We're not going to ask you any. You can keep them yourself. Uh, yeah, no, thank, thank you. Um, so, yeah, um, yeah there's, I've, I've got a few little tricks. But as I said, it's, it's, it's a bit of a lot. lot uh, sorry, a bit of a lottery. But, yeah, if, I think sometimes you can save the penalty before they've taken it. Sort of if you can get in the striker's head by doing certain things. So, yeah, as I said, yeah. The, Disappointing day, but yeah, brush ourselves down and go on uh, Tuesday. And again, Tuesday nights, it's a game that's come very quick and it's an opportunity to brush this on, uh, well, not forget about it altogether, but get onto it and get into a winning momentum again. Yeah, of course. Um, the thing with this in, in this league, especially in August, games come thick and fast. You're playing two games a week, so if you do have a result that you're slightly disappointed with, it's good because straight on you can. Uh, couple of days and we're playing again so uh, as I said we'll be doing everything uh, tomorrow Monday and Tuesday to make sure uh, Tuesday night we, we get a good result and uh, put another good performance in. Okay well thanks for your time Mitch, cheers.